I mean, innovation has led the way to society's advancement since we can remember. Uh, when we talk sometimes nowadays, when we talk about innovation, we think uh, it's this new wave of, you know, new things happening, people changing a lot of processes, which is it's true, but innovation has always happened across humanity. It's not something new, it's not a new process. For us at the EPFL is particularly important because we are a leading university in terms of new technolo of technology, of engineering, uh, which is basically one of the pillars in which uh, you know, society can keep advancing. Uh, technological improve improvements happen across the world. And here at the EPFL, we have exactly that uh, ability to lead that innovation and to direct it also in ways that they can serve the best uh, you know, for society, for the earth, for the environment. Innovation not happens not only, I mean, it's a process that involves multiple actors. Of course, you have the ones that create the technology, but you also need to make sure that the environment is ready at the political level, uh, that you know investors are in um, financing this type of um, enterprises, that you also have research, academic research strongly supporting uh, the different solutions that are being developed. So it takes like an entire ecosystem, as we say, it takes a village to... We want to see this type of technology succeeding and actually being successfully applied, um, in this case, to tackle SDGs, which is especially important for us as Tech for Impact. And for that, we need to make sure that we're bringing all partners into the table and seeing what the needs are, what the, the different you know, points of discussion are for each one of them, what are maybe challenges that they're facing and in which way can we move forward from that and have actual practical conversations and not uh, just leave it at kind of high level discussions. Mm -hmm.